Okay, welcome, my name is Craig and I'm from CC Photography and welcome to the first of a new channel, new playlist that we're going to be running where we're going to just take you through some of the shoots we do, how we did it, how we accomplished it and then also how we retouch and edit that photo. All the secrets revealed, all the tips revealed, everything that we do is just there for you to use. So I hope you guys enjoy this and, uh, and now that you're bored of the image that you've been looking at, um, I'm going to show you how we took this image, how we set it up and then afterwards we're going to go through how we retouch this image. So I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks. Okay, so we'll kick off with what equipment I'm using there. You can see I've got two light stands, two light sources. The single flash head is a Yongnew Mark III. Uh, with a built-in receiver and the trans transmitters on my camera and on the other light stand is a 110 centimeter shoot-through umbrella with a black back to it and inside there I've got three flashes uh, one of them is the Yongnew Mark III which is connected to my transmitter and then the other two are Yongnew Mark IIs uh, which are on slave mode uh, and we need three flashes so we can really pump out a lot of light as we're shooting in the daytime and you can see the trusty camera the Olympus OMD EM1 so for this particular shot that you saw in the beginning of the video uh, you're gonna see how we're gonna set up the light you can see that single light stand at the back is going to be taken now and we're gonna move it to the left hand side of the couple uh, you'll see Kirsten who's my second photographer and very helping hand is moving the light onto the couple's left hand side just behind them to try and create a nice room light and then you can see the umbrella with my assistant Barney is in front of the couple bringing a nice soft light from the front of them and then you can see me disappearing off screen into the grass or into the flowers should I say and then I was photographing through those flowers and various shots, various levels to get the desired effect and then obviously you'll see Kirsten move out of the frame and we've lowered that light where Kirsten is just so that it's at the same level of the couple and not firing over the top of them and yeah that's basically actually the setup of the whole shot and you'll see I take a number of shots different angles um, different positions uh, portrait landscape and you'll see the result was the image that you saw in the beginning which is a, f a really beautiful image it's not a masterpiece but it's it's a good enough photo for the beginning of these videos <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much